So let's see if we can figure out which fraction is greater, 2 thirds or 3 eighths. And we can do this two ways. First, we could try to find a common denominator for both of the fractions here. Denominator, that's the number on the bottom. So if we can get this number to be the same, then the numerator, we can just compare those. And whichever numerator is bigger, that's the larger fraction. So let's try that first. I know I could multiply 3 times 8, and that would give me 24. And I could multiply 8 times 3, and that would give me 24. And now I'd have the same denominator. But I can't just multiply by 8. I have to multiply the top by 8 as well. That way, 8 over 8, if you divide 8 by 8, you get 1. So I'm just multiplying this by 1. It doesn't change the actual quantity. So 2 times 8 is 16, 3 times 8, 24. And 2 thirds is equivalent to 16 over 24. They're really the same number. Down here, we're going to multiply by 3 over 3. That gives us 9 over 24. Now, the denominator, it's the same. So we can compare the numerator. And we can see right away that 16 is larger than 9. So 2 thirds, that's going to be larger than 3 eighths. It'll actually be 7 24ths larger. We could also convert 2 thirds, or 16 24th, to a fraction. So 2 divided by 3, or 16 by 24, gives you 0 0.66, and that number repeats. 9 divided by 24, that gives you 0 0.375. So let's just give ourselves another digit here, and we can see that 0.666 is bigger than 0.375. Once again, 2 thirds, that's a greater fraction or a larger fraction than 3 eighths. This is Dr. B comparing 2 thirds to 3 eighths. 2 thirds is the bigger fraction. Thanks for watching.